Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be doing a video on extensions. Woohoo! I um, have been getting a lot of questions on what extensions I use, how I clip them in, how I style them, kind of all the above. So I'm going to do a video on that. If you want to see how I clip my extensions in and how I can put them in two different ways, depending on what type of fullness and what length they want, then keep watching because this is the extension video for you. Okay, so this is my hair currently without any extensions, which I'm totally content with, but if I want to add volume or length to it, then I like to have that option and that is what extensions are for. My personal favorite extensions are cashmere hair. These things are so amazing. I have tried multiple different brands of extensions and these ones are by far my favorite. And they may be a little on the pricier side of the extensions, um, but I think that they are so worth it. The reason I love these extensions so much is because they blend so well with your hair. And what I typically do when I get my extensions is I take them to my hairdresser, she puts them in my hair how I want them, and then she'll like trim the edges of them and just kind of blend them into my hair, um, just so that they look a little bit more natural, which like you can probably take to any hairstylist and have them clipped in how you want and blend it out and whatever. But they also tone so well. Last fall, I went to like a more darker golden color and then I toned these cashmere hair extensions and they totally took the color and then I went back to being super bright and then toned them again after I had already toned them super gold and they took it again so it's kind of like a good bang for your buck. I've tried toning other cheaper extensions before and they turned like pink. It just does not work out as well as these ones do. So I am going to show you first how I put my extensions in when I want the entire head of hair of extensions, which is a lot, but it's so pretty. When cashmere hair comes, you get a sample first and it's just like, a, it looks just like this, like any regular extension you would get. And you clip it into your hair and you see if it matches. And if it does, great, open the rest of them. And ta-da, you get extensions. If it doesn't, send it back. Do not open the rest of the extensions because then you'll have to pay for it and you don't wanna do that. After you get this one piece and you open the rest of them, you get seven other pieces of hair. So you get three longer ones like this, and they're all different sizes. This is the longest one. And each of them have three clips. Oops. And this is the shortest one. Each of the long extensions all have three clips on them. The shorter extension, not the shorter, but the shorter length extensions, only have two clips, and these ones are the ones that you use typically for the sides of your hair. So there's four short ones, five including the sample, and then three long ones. Got it? So I'm going to use three of the long ones and four of the shorter ones, because I don't really use the sample one, and if I do, it's just a lot of hair. I'm going to show you now how I clip these in. I start about right above my ears and then I make a U-shape downwards towards the bottom of my hair. You can kind of see how little hair is down there, but I make a U-shape from my ears all the way down to here. So the first piece I use of all the extensions is the medium length three clip. And when I say medium length, I mean from up here, not the length of the actual hair. And then I just clip that in. So you can see it goes like right underneath my boobs. 
Then I do the same exact thing, make a U-shape, but just like an inch higher. The next piece of hair that I use is the long three clip. Ta-da! Go U-shape up. The next piece I use is the shortest three clip. And that one's really short in the back of my hair. Then I let the rest of my hair down, pull it all forward. And then for the side pieces, I do two on each side. I'll do one like right here and one right here. So I start with the bottom one first and I kind of go like right above my eyebrow. And clip that in. Make sure when you do them, you're still um, doing a diagonal, like inserting them diagonally. Just makes it look a little bit more natural and not so straight across. And that's one side. And then same thing on the other side, just right above my eyebrow, diagonally down. Oops. Diagonal again. These are the 20 inch extensions, I believe. Yes, they have 16 inch, 18 inch, and 20 inch, and I got the 20 inches, and I trimmed them a little tiny bit just to make them perfect. So now I am going to show you guys what I do with 20 inch extensions when I don't feel like wearing an entire head of hair. Of extensions so basically like if I'm going out and I just want a little bit more volume and I don't feel like wearing all this hair or if it's hot outside but I still want volume this is what I do so I've taken all of the extensions out again and I have nothing in my hair right now so I like my hair but I just think it could use a little bit more fullness. I don't want it to be longer. I just want thickness. I'm going to take the longest length three clip and I'm going to put this in at like the top of my head so that when it's in, it's the same length of my hair. I do like a crown on the top of my head. Can you kind of see that? It just starts up here, circles around the back. Same thing on this side. Clip that up, and then I take this, clip it in where I've parted, bring it forward to make sure it's a good length. Looks good to me. So then what I do is I take one uh, small clip that's like the smaller length with two clips and I'm going to clip it in just like how I did when I do my other type of extensions at the top of my hair on the sides. Then I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Spray it, just give it that fluff. Ta-da, and I'm ready to go out for my day. There's not too much hair, it's not super heavy. It's just the perfect amount of extensions right now. I think it just goes to show that you don't have to buy two 
completely separate length of extensions. It just depends on like how you clip them in, where you clip them in, how many you're clipping in. I'm going to link Cashmere's website down below. I will link these extensions down below. My shade is Sunset Blonde, but I have toned these. So they are a little bit brighter than what they typically are. The people there are super sweet. They're so happy to help you find the perfect shade for you. If you send them in a picture of your hair, they will respond like nearly immediately and help you find the perfect extensions for you. So I hope you guys like this video. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, do all those things that I always tell you to do. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye guys.